Hello, everybody. Good morning and welcome back to the Predator Doubles Tournament. And we start today the first match of the quarterfinals round. So, commentating with me, Luis Gabriel Arias. Hello, Luis. How are you? Hi, Alberto. Uh, but I think in your side of the world, it's good afternoon, right? Good morning is for me, for this side of the world. No, it's morning here as well. 10 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> so, good morning to everyone. I'm very excited to be here. Hi, guys. Yeah, and we have two great teams today. We have the first team from the Philippines Power Break with Ivan Maluto and Elijah Alvarez. Sir. Hello. Hello, sir. Yeah, they won the first game against the Hungry Bunnies by 2-0. And then on the right side, we have the Polish team, Siumate Mess team with Wojciech Szewczyk and Mateusz Niogoski. Hello, guys. How are you? Hi, hi. How are you guys? Very good, thanks. Thanks. Yeah, so, let's see, Luis, the first break. Showmate. Yeah. Showmate won the first match against our TV and Hillary by 2 0 as well. All, all the matches results were 2 0. Yeah, we haven't been able to have a, a decider. Chef almost scratch on the break, but he made one ball, so I think he will take one in hand. Same situation for Ivan. So Voschek is going for 10 or for 15 of them? Uh, yeah, 10 points. And also Malut. Mm -hmm. So I think both racks should be okay. I'm not sure about Ivan if he can make the six on the side, but I, it looks okay. I don't think so. I think it's available. Yeah. So yeah, I think it should be okay. Wojciech is going to play the four on the side. Soft shot, I think. Yeah, like that. Good shot. And now he needs to stop the cue ball more or less in the center of the table. So, yeah, it looks like Ivan. Is able to play the six on the side. Oh, and tough situation now for Wojciech. I mean, he needs to get through the nine and the ten, but the scratch is on. Maybe he's gonna try and leave a long shot on the eight. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, hit the 10 and hmm. close to the, the cushion. Oh, Ivan is sweating after that shot. He 
ti ali imaš misli, ej. So, one more ball for him. To score 10 points. And he did it, 10 points for power break. And let's see now, voice check. He was long and behind. I don't know if he wanted to play it on the side or... Yeah, I think he tried to find position for the side, but probably he needs a bank shot now. Oh no, he played on the side. Oh, good shot. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, good shot. Good and... shot. Yeah, perfect. For this last time ball. And he finished the rack. So 10 points for both teams. Now turn for Elijah and Mateus. So we start the second inning now. Or is it dry from Mateus? Yeah. Yes. Break. Oh, so zero points for him. Elijah made one ball and he has a good shot on the one. But look at the 10 and the 7. Yeah, and the 2. I mean, I think he cannot play the 2 on the left corner pocket so it's fine probably yeah where he's putting the hand so let's see the shot oh is he gonna scratch Ooh, that was really close almost So Elijah is playing for 15 points. So it could be the first one to run out for the power break team. Good shot on the two. Do you think the seven goes on the bottom right corner pocket? No, right? Mm, could be. On oh, could be on the left. I don't know. Difficult to say. Difficult to say, but let's see. Yeah, looks like he can play the seven on the left side. On the left corner pocket, I mean. So, good angle on the six.
So yeah. Looks like he can play the seven. Luis, referee. <laughs> you you think it was okay? I really I, think we need to to see the replay because I was quiet thinking about it was a foul or not. Yeah, it looked so like I, I will ask the the technical team Andres to watch it again because 50-50. Mm, I I I'm not sure about it. I think it was fall. Andres can we check it? Thank, thank you. So guys, don't worry. We want to check it because we think it was a foul. So do we keep on playing or and check later, or we'll check now? I I rather check it now if we can. Yeah. Can, if, so if we can, yes, if we can, uh, please stop for a couple of minutes, guys. Don't break, please. We're gonna check the the shot so we can have the score right and everyone is. It's okay. So when we start the the, set, the the next inning, so please give us a couple of minutes. Sí, estoy mirando. So guys, the good thing about this format is that it's online. So we have the video and we can watch it and make sure that the shot counts or not. So we're checking right now to make sure the match is fair. Yeah, I, I think it was for Luis because, because of the way the cue ball went out after the shot. Okay. I think, yeah, I, I, yeah, I think he touched first the seven. I mean, first the 10 ball because... Mm. The way the move, the cue will move, right? If it if it is hit the seven yeah. first, it wouldn't Maybe. go that that direction. Yeah, if he would hit the seven, it would went more straight. So, so how many points would would it be with that for corner counting that foul? It was uh, three. It was seven points, I think. Yeah. Okay, so it would be seven points for him because of the foul. Yeah, no turn for Boschek and Ivan. Yeah, we can go. Yes, yes, break. you can break, guys. Sorry for the for the delay. <laughs>
Okay, so both had good breaks. I think Vostik has the toughest layout because he has the the tool. I don't know if it has, if it has a pocket. I don't think so. So he needs to get there. He's gonna bump it. So he's gonna try guys to make the one on the side and bump the two to be able to make it on the bottom left corner part. So Ivan is playing for 15 and Wojciech for 10, right, please? Sorry? 15 points. For who? I mean, playing. Ivan is playing for 15 points, right? Yes, and Wojciech is playing for 10. So now Maluto has a a shot, as I call it, on the on the blind side. That shots are not easy because we usually overcut it, overcut them. But I hope he makes it. Last check is perfect on the seven. If he's on the good side of the seven, he's able to to go upwards for the eight. Maluto is perfect, so I think we're gonna we're gonna see fifteen and ten points. Yeah, it looks like. So 15 points for Ivan and the poor break team. And perfect position for the pen. So that's another 10 points for mess team. Now in number four and it's turn for Elijah and Mateus. So yeah, some people talking about this fall, but yeah, we watched the replay and after the reaction of all the balls, we really think that it was a fall shot. And that's another drive from Mateus, please. Yes. He needs wow. to change something because yeah. this could end the set for them. Yeah, and Jason Nguyen send us 50 stars, please. Nuhid, how are you, buddy? We missed you. I've seen you play in a couple of videos, live streams that, that you've made. You're shooting great, buddy. 
hope you're staying safe and having fun. Oh, look at that great break from Elijah. Yes, great break. Look at the one and the two. <laughs> yeah. Both in a pocket. I don't know if you agree, Alberto, but I think the Wonder Boy plays, he has a style similar to Carlo Viado. Of course, he's from the Philippines and whatever, but something about his stroke that is a little bit like Carlo. What do you think? Yeah, they could look a bit similar. Well, anyway. We're sure that Elijah has a bright future. Yeah, I mean, he's playing great. Oh, look at this position. Wow, perfect on the three. I thought he wanted to play soft to place the cue ball next to the center of the table and then play the three on the other corner pocket. But look at that, he made it perfect. Beat over the speed on that one, but it's okay for him to play the five on the side. It's perfect. He plays great. And he looks so relaxed. I mean, Well, great run out from him. And that's 15 points for the power break team. Now turn for Wojciech and Ivan, inning number five. And power break is leading with 47 points. And the next team has 20 points. So one more Good down break. For... But again, there I mean he's in trouble with the two. He has yeah. a shot of one, the nine is on the pocket, the five is close to the pocket, but getting to the two is not easy. Yeah, that's he, right. He's always getting in trouble with that two. Probably he can, yeah, he can lift the cue ball in the center of the table and he can make the two, but then he has another problem with the three. So I would risk because, you know, even with holding hand, it's difficult. So he should give a try for 15 points. Ivan took ball in hand, so he's playing for 10. And Jason said us that we are the best guys of Predator One Pool, Luis. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, buddy. Thank you, buddy. It was a pleasure commentating when you had that, that great run in our tournament. We hope to see you play again. I mean, yeah. guys, we're here. We're here to support the players. I mean, we're basically 20% commentators and 80% like a support system for you guys. So <laughs> for us, it's a pleasure. What do you think he's going to do with the three, Albert? Probably Frank? Try, try to find the gap between the 10 and the four. Oh, he touched the 10 ball first. Wow. So two points, right? that's, yeah, two points. <laughs> 
for it them. It was very, very tough layout. I mean, that's a classical, a typical layout that you want to play a safety. Yeah, it was pretty difficult one. Whoa. Oh, um, I've missed. Yeah, he punched it. He punched it and uh, the pocket gave it away. So it was four, four points. points. Now turn for Elijah and Mateus. Let's see if Mateus is able to make a ball on this break. Probably he will change something. So let's see. So it was another try from Mateus. Yeah. Very yes. good. Wow. How times for him. Well, um, Elijah is playing for 10 points with the ball in hand, and the table looks pretty open for him with a good position from three to four. I think we should finish this one. Yeah, perfect. He looks really confident this time. So it was 10 points. Now in number seven, turn for voice check on Ivan. Break. Boschek. Let's see Ivan. Wow, three break. Yeah, looks dry. Dirty. Wow. Both balls were so close to fall in on the side. But they didn't sell zero points for them. And ball in hand for Borchek. He's playing for 10 points. No. Great shot on the side. Yeah. That's a very tough shot. Not only making the two, but protecting the line on the three. No, that was a great shot. Yeah, it was really great. So six on the side? I wouldn't think so. <laughs> I think that goes on the bottom right corner block. It's a natural shot, but I don't know. Oh, he missed? It was very tough to make that, that shot on the side pocket. Oh, what happened? Six points. Yeah, six points, but this mistake was strange. I don't know. I think he need, 
he got short when he drew the five and he had in mind to play it on the bottom right corner pocket, but he said, no, I can play it on the side, but I think that's a very tough shot. Yeah, anyway, now turn for Elijah and Mateus. Inning number eight. And Mateus needs one ball on this break. Yeah, finally, he made two balls on this break. No shot on the one, but... He should be okay with ball in hand. And look at this break from Elijah. <laughs> He's breaking great. Oh, ah, yeah, it's okay. You can make this two ball, I think. Maybe not. So Elijah is playing for 15 points and Mateus is playing for 10. Yes. Right shot, but oh. he, he can play the three? Yeah, I think so. Uh, good shot by Mateus. And let's see Elijah with another good shot. And let's see now. Looks like he can play the three on the left top corner pocket. And probably he could make the car on, on the four ball as well. Let's see. Yeah, he made the four. And he's good on the three. Great shot by Elijah. Amazing. This kid is amazing. How yeah. old is he? Do you know, guys? Put it on Facebook. Do you know how old is him? Yeah, and that was 10 points for Mateus in a great run out. But I think after this shot now, this eight ball from Elijah, they won the first set. Yes, they won. Yeah, the difference was too big because Mateo has been struggling with the breaks. Yeah, so now the team cannot reach in points, so the set is over, and now we start the second set. So it's turn again for Ivan and Wojciech. So we start now. Don't we change it for the second set? The order. No, this it's the same order. order. Okay, same okay, order. okay, sure. So, Luis, probably said us that he's 16 years old. Oh my God, really, guys? I thought you were going to say like 18. I feel so old. <laughs> yes, we are, Luis. <laughs> No, but but I love that kid. I mean, he's so like I don't know, quiet and I don't know his personality while he's playing is I think it's very nice. Is it try from Wojciech? No, no, he made one ball. Okay, yeah, he made a ball. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, you're right, Luis. Elijah is great. You know, some players after this fall shot could 
play different after that, but he, he, he kept playing the same way and he was able to make 15 points after that, then 10 and other 15, so it was really good. So I think I was check is a little long on the tour, right? Yeah, but oof, let's see if he can avoid the three ball. Yeah, it should, it should be okay. Good shot in the two. So both players are playing for 15 points. Let's see this long shot from Ivan. And he has a tough. Oh, uh -oh. look at the cue ball. Two points, right? Yeah, two points. So two points for power break. Could be a great chance for the mess team to get a good lead. On this first inning. So again on the side, Luis. Yes, but yes. Probably this is a little bit easier because a little it's closer to the side. And if he rolls it, he gets a shot on the, on the nine. But the six, it wasn't that easy. He was further up the table, a longer shot, and he needed to hit it with more pace because of position. So that's why I thought he was going to play that six on the bottom right corner block. Oh, he will throw that shot mm -hmm. now. Oof. Let's see this timber now. It's an important one. It's Very important. <laughs> yeah, it's six points. Because the power break team is playing amazing, so... Is he playing the bank? I don't know. No, cut shot. Oh, oh he missed. Yeah, very tough, very tough. Oh. So, guys, nine points for the mess team. Now turn for Mateus and Elijah. Second inning of the second set. And that's a dry break from Mateus. Wow. He's really in trouble with the break in this match. So, zero points. And look at Elijah. With another good break. Tough shot on the one, so I think. He will take one hand. Do you think he's going for it, Alberto? 
I don't think so. I think it's the beginning of the set, I th and I think he should take one in hand. But looks like he's going for it. It's a really tough shot, this one. And he made it. He made it so. I like just playing for 15 points. So let's see this pipe ball, please. Where he will play the pipe. Oh. I think he, he felt a little short, right? Yeah. I think so. He was a bit short on that stroke, but it's a similar shot than the one ball he made at the beginning. This one probably a bit more difficult. Especially because of the position for the six. Yeah, I mean, he needs to zigzag horizontally in the table, but I think the nine is there. So I don't know if he's going to look to go above, make the five, and then shoot the six on the bottom of the corner block. Can he stay with it in the in a line to be able to make the six on the top left corner block, Alberto? What do you think? Because the cube is going to go left, right, left. But the nine is there. He could hit the nine. Yeah, but I think he will try to go to the other side of the table. Okay. So he's going above. Yeah. Okay. The way he's right. aiming looks like he wants to put the cue ball between the six and the seven, probably. And I'm not sure now if he can play the six on the side. Looks like, yeah. No, no on the side or bottom left corner pocket. We have the same discussion that with boss check. I <laughs> think he needs to play on the bottom left corner pocket. Yeah, but he can go left, right, and left and have a shot on the, on the seven. Yeah, but he's playing on the side. Oh, my God. Good shot. <laughs> no, I mean, he's a wonder, but I'm not. But I think... If you're going to play percentages and you're playing a world championship or US Open or whatever, I think the right shot is on the bottom left corner. Probably. What do you think, Alberto? Would you play the side? Yeah, I think if it depends on the table, you know. But okay. if, That's if, fair. That's if, fair. if you're confident enough and your table is okay on the sides, I think it was a correct shot because. The position for the seven was easier. No. Oh, look at that. Yeah, eight points. It's the nine. Yes. I think he moved on the shot. Yeah, so eight points for them. Now turn for Ivan and Wojciech. Wow, I didn't expect that miss. You know, after all the great shots he made. But well, sometimes it happens, guys. Good break from Wojciech, but I think he has to take one hand. Uh, 
Ivan made one ball and he has a great opportunity to play for 15. He's perfect on the five. Yeah, so Ivan is playing for 15 points and Wojciech is playing for 10. Good shots. Yeah, two great draw shots from Ivan. I like that pink glove. You should have one, Alberto, for your match. <laughs> yeah. I think it's Kamui, right? I think that's a Kamui. Yeah. Do you like it, this pink glove? Yeah, I do. I actually do. I think is if you're wearing like a black uh, pool uh, uniform, I mean the the way you dress for a tournament, it has a lot of black. I think it's very cool to have the pink uh, glove. Yeah, I think so. Okay, great run out from Bocek. No problems on it. So that's ten points for the mess team. Well, nice comment from Mark. Practice always the best medicine. Yeah, you're right. Then, good shots from Elijah. A place where there is mosquitoes and other flies. Yeah, looks like we cannot see it. Where? The camera. Uh, Elijah. Yeah, I said, no, I see one. I see one. I saw a very big mosquito. It was like a little dragon. I saw it. I hope to see him travel and play in the big tournaments, at least when he's 18 or I think him and how old is the other Philippine player uh, that is a kid? Um, Anton Raga. I, I, think don't he, know. I think he played. Oh, he missed. Oh, uh, I've missed. I think he wow. Anton played for the first time internationally at the 2019 China Open. And that I think he won. So I hope to see him in the Wonder World playing together with Carlo Viago and Dennis Orcoyo and other big names from the Philippines because Philippines is the, the center of the pool world. I mean, no other country plays more pool than them. Great break from Mateus. Yeah, this one was really good one. Perfect shot on the one. Does the nine go on the right side? Or is it frozen? It looks tough from here. I'm going to make it bigger on the screen. Okay. I'm not sure if it goes with... I, I don't think it goes. Well, we will know soon 
<laughs> Maybe he can make a Francisco Sanchez Breeze, make a car to lift it, lift the ball up. Yeah, he has a lot of shots before, so could be. Let's see. So, Pablo, pink trousers are much better, right? <laughs> yeah. What did he said? What did he say? Sorry. Pink trousers instead of pink glove. Because you, you know, before, like a few years ago, when I was able to post some drills on Facebook, you I had used a pink to, trouser? Yeah, I used to make them on, on pink trousers. <laughs> <laughs> Alberto, I mean, come on. First that, and now your haircut. You always <laughs> need to, to, to have attention. Something yeah. when you're playing, you need to uh, gain attention. I mean. Yeah, I need attention, like a baby. <laughs> I need it too, but I'm not with pink trousers. I'm gonna use a pink glove. I mean, you need to 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 get attention with style, Alberto. Come on. <laughs> so it looks like Mateus is gonna play it on the side. No, in the corner. Yes, I think in the corner he he has a very good position. Yeah. And Jan Pasqua said that it's open area where almost like a jungle. Oh, I think he's talking about the where Laya is. Yeah, yeah, where Laya is playing. Okay, okay, but I mean, the, his stream quality is great. I mean, his internet is is great. So if he's if he's in a jungle in Philippines, great job for him on having yeah. that internet and that table and. The whole setting, I mean, it's very nice. Yeah, you're right. So, 15 points for Mateus. Right run out. Now he was able to make a ball on the break. And Elijah is playing for 10. And there he goes. So now turn for Wojciech and Ivan. In number three, uh, in number five, break number three for them. <laughs> okay, two balls on the side from voice check, and one from Ivan. So I think they need to take one in hand. I don't know if you noticed, but Alberto, but Voschek is always getting a cluster at the bottom center of the table. He's always getting five balls there, very close. Yeah. That's why he is having some troubles at the beginning of the racks. So both players are playing for 10 points. Ooh. That shot from both check. I thought he was going to try and get straight on the three to make a stop shot with a little draw to make the the five either on the corner or the side. Yeah. But he almost missed the two ball. It was really, really close. So the four innings, the mess team is leading with 34 points and 27 points for power break. The first set was for the power break team. But looks like this set will be closer. Solomon Manalo says, our internet service is the fastest. 
if we live in Mars. <laughs> but mm -hmm. it looks great, buddy. It looks great. I mean, the stream is great. The table, I mean, the whole setting, great job. If you're in the jungle and you're doing this job, imagine if you were in another city. I mean, congratulations. Good long chat from Ivan. And Borshek is in troubles again. Cut shot on the six to make the bank shot. Oh no, I think he's he will try the car on the ten. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Well, so it was 10 points for Ivan. The thing is, Alberto, that if he tries a car to make the 10, I don't know if he's going to have enough pace, speed, to be able to get the 10 to the corner. I don't know if you, you understand what I mean. Yeah. I mean, but... in, it's a cut, and it's a cut the 10, right? Yeah, but he will, so hit, he will hit hard, so it will not be a problem. So he's going to make an Alberto, your favorite yeah. shot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, close your eyes and hit. <laughs> Very thin and boom. Oh, look See? at that. He made it. <laughs> <laughs> wow, and look look at the six ball. Wow. Trick shot from Wojciech. And... Beautiful shot, buddy. Yeah. Amazing. See, every time you coach Alberto, they do the shot. I mean, why don't you coach me? You never coach me. I can try it. No, so... no, you never coach me. <laughs> <laughs> so we need number six now. Turn for Elijah and Mateus. And wow, what a great shot from great shot. the mess great team. Shot. <laughs> so they keep leading the score. 44 points and 37 for power break. I'm sure and I hope that that punch pool, the Instagram account, post that video. Yesterday he posted the video that you coached Margaret Alberto on the thin cut also. <laughs> and people went crazy with that shot from Margaret. So I think Voschek needs and deserves that video also. <laughs> yeah. Totally right. Yeah, bowling hand for the Wonder Boy. Yeah, but the rest of the table is, is a very nice layout for him. I mean, yeah. the pattern of the balls is very nice. Two to the three, yep. going up for the four. The five is right there. So, let's see Mateus. Mateus needs to make some work on this layout. I shot on the two. And then the four ball is free to make it on the top bottom corner pocket. And yeah, it looks good for him. <coughs> yeah, Elijah is having all the time really good open tables. Yeah, he has a great break. Similar to Carlo Biado. Carlo Biado breaks similar. Very open table, yeah. couple of balls. Yeah, and Carlo Biado had also a few problems with mosquitoes, right? Probably mosquitoes. Yes, same. Can, yeah, see? Yeah. They're probably, the same. Probably mosquitoes can help you to have an Dude. open table. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I remember him moving the the queue, the, the queue remember? Yeah, yeah. That's <laughs> I'm moving the queue above the table, like telling the mosquitoes to go away. Yeah, so 10 points for Elijah. Perfect on the seven. I mean, yeah. this Mateus is showing to be very resilient and a very mentally strong player because... Usually, guys, and I, I hope you agree with me, Alberto, when a player gets 
several dry breaks, they lose their confidence totally. I mean, they're not able to come back. And he had a lot of dry breaks in the first set. And now that he's found his break, he's playing amazing. So mentally, he's very strong. Yeah, and if you count every time he made the ball, he was able to finish the rack. 10 points and 15. And he's on the way for another 10. I'll reach out on the corner. Yeah, most of the players, after having a lot of jerks, even when they make a ball afterwards, they miss because they they lose confidence. Yeah. So that's 10 points for the mess team. Now in number seven, turn for Ivan and Wojciech. Well, 54 points for the mess team and 47 for power break. Oh, is it a scratch from Bocek? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so scratch. That's so, your points for them. This opens a window for power break. So, Iago Lopez said that Anton lost that final against Gu. I think he's talking about uh, your comment before about Anton, Luis. Uh, what did he say? He said that he lost the final against Gu. Uh, you're right, buddy. He, uh, he lost against Wu Chachin and he beat at the semifinals uh, Eklenkachi. But again, I mean, first major tournament uh, that he played internationally and he gets to the final. And the China is one of the hardest uh, fields to play. I mean, that shows you that if he traveled more, he would, he would be very, very strong competitor for the elite players in the world. Yeah, so let's see if Ivan is able to avoid the scratch on the side. I think he has enough space. I mean, with this type, with this type of matches, guys, and I struggle with myself because I love the style of the Filipino players. I mean, they have such a great style with the. With, where they play such natural talent. and the, But I love European players playing because of their fundamentals, et cetera. So I struggle. I'm like, okay, I have no favorite. Both styles are great and that's it. So, yeah, some comments saying that Chaco said that he agreed with you, Luis. Larry said that Anton Raga is one of the strongest money game players in the Philippines. Yeah, and I would say the world. I mean, in Temple, I would put Anton in top 10 in the world. For sure. Top 10 in the world, Temple. Oh, good shot from Ivan. Perfect shot. 
You were, it was all about the speed, it was amazing. He's not on the good angle on the eight, but he's okay to play three, four rails now and find a good shape for the nine. Yeah, like that. Mm -hmm. So oh, let's see now. He's playing for 15 points, so these last two balls are really important. So, good shot from Ivan, and that's okay. 15 points for them. So, inning number eight, now turn for Elijah and Mateus. Jason said that Luis, Mark, and I, that we are the top 10 best in the world for commentary. <laughs> I'm not top 10 as a commentator, but being funny, yes, I am top 10 in the world. Thank you. <laughs> I know I am. Now, not so much because it's very early here in Venezuela, but in the next match, guys, prepare yourselves because I'm going to be very, very funny. Yeah, great break from Elijah. Ball in hand for him. Yes, he needs to take ball in hand. Yeah. I think this is the first time he gets uh, some type of cluster. He's been breaking so well in terms of having an open table. Yeah, but make the one now. It's open. <laughs> yes. Now is the same break that he always makes. You're right, Albert. Whoa. Oh, good combo from Mateus. Boom. Uh, That's a Tony Robles friendly bumperoni. <laughs> so Mateus is playing for 15 points. Let's see. Yeah, Chaco is asking if Maluto is not playing from the Philippines. And yeah, Jason replied in the comments. He said that he's playing in Abu Dhabi. As same as other Filipino players, they that played one pool before and they are playing for from the same pool room that pool room looks great yeah very beautiful and thank you jason for clearing that out but it looks amazing that pool room yeah so it was 10 points for elijah Thank you. 
Oh, good follow shot. Uh, a little short. Where would you play the nine, Alberto? I would play it on the top left, not the right. I would play on the right. See, we ne you never coach me. See what I I'm telling you, Alberto? <laughs> Mateo says say something, but we didn't hear him. Okay. Something to us or to. Or maybe to himself, like angry. Yeah, I don't know. Okay. Let's hope he's okay. Alberto, he's playing <laughs> to the left. <laughs> now he needs to make it. If not, I want to lose my point. Oh, see? he made it. Uh, Let's see the keyboard. <laughs> see, Albertico. Oh, there you go. <laughs> He proved my theory, guys. For once, this is the first time in one year that I've been commentating with Alberto Delgado that I'm right on a shot. Boom! Mm. You just asked me if I would play it on the right or on the left. I said on the right. <laughs> <laughs> so, right run out from Mateus. Beautiful, beautiful. Yes. Mateus, you did great, buddy. And now, last two innings, turn for... Ivan and Wojciech. And look at the score now. It's so uh -huh. close. Three points of difference. 72 points for power break and 69 for the next team. Well, Wojciech made two balls on the break and look at that. He has a good shot on the one. It's crunch time, guys. <laughs> yeah. I've made two balls on the break. Yeah. That's a shot on yes. the two. Yes, but he needs to stay in the line to bounce off the lower side of the table. But So, Wojciech is playing for 15 points. We have Carol send, send him. Flags from, from Poland in the comments. So, guys, both teams need your support. So, show it on the comments. Yes. Put a flag, guys. Oh, let's see this position from Buczek. Oh, perfect. Perfect on the side. He's okay. Yeah. And Ivan got small. He's on the six, but he's okay. Okay, the three. So the last swinging of this set, this set would be really interesting. I'm gonna say it, Alberto. I think we're gonna to go to a decider. <laughs> you hope so. I hope yeah. so, but I, I feel it. I feel like we're gonna to go to a desire. I don't know why. Yeah, it could be. Oh, great shot from Ivan. So we'll check on the 10 ball to score 15 points.
and he made it. So Beautiful. 15 points for the mess team. Oh, yeah, great one and perfect position. The six. So all the players, two hundred percent focused for the last inning. I thought he was going to forward the cue ball to make the eight on the top right corner for, to follow it. Bounce off the right rail. And... Yeah, but he has to play the seven. No, no I didn't see the seven. Sorry. <laughs> it was like, I would have followed it. Yeah, you're right. From here, the seven looks the same color as the cloth. <clears throat> Jaco ask, are the balls that Maruto is using side top? Yeah. Yeah, I think so because the seven ball of cyclop balls are is like kind of blue, like light blue. So one more ball for Ivan to score 15 points and keep the lead. So Luis, last inning, last break for both teams. Three points of difference and it's turn for Elijah Mateus. So the mass team needs 15 okay. and with 10 power break loses the set so yeah power break leads three points yeah yeah yes okay so probably guys we're gonna see the players trying to make 15 do or die yeah it depends on the break now Elijah made one ball on the side. And... Oh my God. Wow. Looks like, it's like a horror movie. <laughs> horror movie. It's like a horror If you're the opponent, look at Elijah. But also, I mean, Mateus can see the one. Yeah, yeah. He has a long shot on the one, but it's not easy. <laughs> no, it's not easy. And, and when he, he tries to get position on the eight, it is close to the 10, so... Yeah, so Elijah is playing for 15. No, for sure he's playing for 15. I mean, he's playing, he's playing for 20 without break. I mean... Yeah. He's playing for all-in. All-in. All-in at the casino, baby. So, Mateus, I think he should make the same to the risk. Yes, I think he should. he should risk it. Wow, great wow. shot from Mateus. What a shot. And Elijah almost scratched on the corner. <laughs> wow. He got a kiss on the on the nine. And it was really risky. But look at that now. What about the position for the four? Yes. He needs to give it reggaeton right now. Boom. Yeah, he played cushion first. I think what? so. Oh, he's think... hooked. Yes, he's hooked. And yes, I think he played cushion first, a lot of spin. Yeah. But he, he felt a little short. I mean, it's, it wasn't easy. Yeah, so now, jump shot. Jump. jump. 
pressure jump. Yeah. Ooh. Not so good position for Mateus in the shot, but he can make it. Well, and Luis Wendy sent us 45 stars. This Wendy, thank you so much. Yeah, thanks a lot. So, tough shot for both players. Very tough shot for both players. Especially if you count that they are under so big pressure at this moment. He's going to no. kick it? Yeah, he's going to oh kick my it. Dear baby Jesus. Two rays, I think. Oh, look at the shot. Oh. And look at the position. Oh, wow. Dear God. What is wrong or right with the mess team? I mean, first the uh, check shot and now Mateus makes this. Guys, there are kids watching the stream. Come on. <laughs> what a shot from Mateus. Amazing, amazing. But he should keep focused. Yes. Oh, Elijah almost made it. Almost. It was really close. Good effort. Yes, yeah, so it was four points for power yes. break. Four yeah. points. They have 91. So... So, messing with one more ball. They will have the same score than poor break, right? Yeah. Yeah, so two balls, they win the set, and we go to our first decider, guys. Oh, look at this throw shot from Mateus. Is it enough? Oh, he's oh my <laughs> totally God. straight on the eight. <laughs> Mateus, you're going to kill us. Do I need all of them? Uh, you need one more, I think. If I'm one not more. wrong, yeah, one more to win the set. Okay, so Alberto, just to to recap, the the team, if we go to a decider, the team with the most points between the two sets chooses who starts the decider round, right? And then uh... we go one by one. Okay, so confirmed by the technical team. I'm 50% awake, and that's the way. So we need to add the points of the two sets for each of the teams. The team with the most amount of points chooses who starts, and then at the same order of the of the sets, we go one by one. And then after that extra inning, the team with the most points in that extra inning wins the match. So it was the oh, winner ball. Yeah, it's enough, but you can finish the rack. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> okay, guys. So we're going to a decider. Uh, Alberto, can you add the points to see who's going to choose who starts? Yeah, so it was 15 points now for Mestin, right? So that's... Mm -hmm. How many points in total between the two sets? I, I think the power break has more points. Okay. Okay, so the power breaks has more points. So they, they can choose who starts, either them 
or the mass team. So uh, I'm going to ask uh, Maluto. I think he speaks English, right? Maluto, how are you, buddy? I'm late. I'm starting. Okay. Start. You want to start? Yeah, I'm starting. Okay. So, so, so they so, choose. Mm -hmm. So, okay. Uh, you will be playing one, one by one. First you, then second Wojciech, third uh, Elijah, and last Mateus. Is it okay? Perfect. Okay. Good luck, buddy. I will start now. Yes, sir. Okay. So good luck. Good luck. Yes, Alberto's perfect. One by one, guys. We're going to start with Maluto, our first decider of the tournament. I'm so excited. Yeah, first decider. <laughs> Yeah, and with two great teams. <laughs> I mean, two great teams. So, We the ball, perfect cue ball control, and I don't know if the one goes. I don't know if the one goes. I don't know, Alberto, he can play the one. He touches the cushion, then the ball, and then goes. I don't know. I don't think so. I think it's a better option for him to make the caron probably, touch the one, make the seven. But he should take ball in hand. Yes, and I don't know if the. I don't know if it goes. Yeah, he will play the seven for sure, I think. Looks like the one okay. doesn't go. So he made the carom. Now he has a good, good shot on the one, but it's tough to get position for the two. Looks like he overdraw that shot. But looks like he can cut the two ball on the side. Yeah, I think so. Very tough shot, but I think it's, it's available. Jaco asking about how much on an advantage different way from the balls is I have heard that cyclo balls are slightly lighter. Yeah, I don't know. Difficult to judge for me because I didn't play that much with cyclo balls. What about you, Luis? I've never tried them. I've always played with the RMS balls, but I've tried. Whoa, great shots. Ooh, great shots on the side. Okay? But... I think it's just a six to three. Yeah, it looks like. But I've tried. But I've tried different levels of Aerosmith balls. One of them, the Continentals, they're cheaper and they're lighter. And I think when the balls are lighter, it's harder to play because you don't get the reaction that you want most of the time. So I don't. I'm not saying that heavier balls is better for your game, but lighter balls is definitely worse for your game. But they tell me Cyclops balls are great. I think Jason Shaw made a tournament on, on the weekend and it, they play with Cyclops balls. Oh, great shot from Ivan. Great. Yeah, I tried. I, I played with cycle, cycle balls in China. And, but you know, it's difficult to judge because you also play on different cloth. Uh, different tables. Yes, so it, it's not only about the balls. 
Yes, I agree. But there should be the, more or less the same quality as yeah, the they're, arm turning yeah, they're, balls. I mean, they are quite good. The ones that I want to try are the Predator balls. Have you tried them, Alberto? Oh, not really. Okay. I also want. Uh, I think they they should shoot great and they look amazing. I love the the Predator logo on the on the balls. Now this is a, a very tough shot. Yeah. This shot, Alberto, do you slow roll it or do you punch it? I think I would slow roll it because you get good position for the nine. If we play like that. But I think he's going to draw it. Oh my bit. God, perfect. Yeah. Wow, great shot. So Chaco said, thank you, Luis. They use Cyclo quite a lot in the US, I think. I guess all conditions matters. Yeah, I think I, they, they are using it a lot now because looks like Diamond has kind of agreement with Cyclop. So, oh, okay. okay. Yeah, Makes sense. So that's why. Well, oh, not so good. On I don't this. know why he drew it. Yeah, probably he was too straight. Oh my God! He made it. It barely went in, but great run up. Very tough layout. Yeah. So Great. it was ten points for power break. Now turn for Bocek. Uh, let's see, guys. Uh, a lot of pressure, guys. Okay, which a good one ball on the side, and he has a good shot on the one. So it could be 15 points for the mess team. Let's see. You know, on the break, he got a uh, first kiss. Looks, looks like he was going to scratch. But then he okay. got another kiss with the two ball. He has a great layout. Because the seven is, is not on the table. So from the six to the eight is a perfect line. Yeah. I think the key shot in this rack would be from four to six. It's okay, he can draw the three, get an angle on the four to be able to draw it to the six. He needs to get on the right side of the six so that when he gets that draw tension line, he gets a shot on the eight on the same pocket. I think it's okay. Yeah, but it will not be that easy. He has to avoid the scratch on the side. After the four, so let's see. Uh, 
Uh, it looks good. Yeah, I think with that angle, it's hard to scratch on the side. What do you think, Alberto? Mm, I don't know. It's always easy to scratch. <laughs> <laughs> Especially if you're playing Capolin, of course, Alberto. In yeah. that game, you're supposed to scratch. In this one, you're not. So, good shot. Okay. Yeah. Another good shot. Oof. Bit over speed, but well, let's see the side ball. Not the best shot to make on a decider, but We can feel the pressure, Luis. Yes. Do you think he's going to draw it? Yeah, I think so. Or go forward. Okay. Oh, no. Used to rails. Oof. Really good shot. Yes. Mm -hmm. a lot a lot of quality in that stroke yeah he has really good stroke even too much sometimes I remember when he played the, one of the Whirlpool Masters he made one shot on the side and the ball went into the pocket and then it came back to the table what really really so and did it count i mean no it doesn't it have... when it happened it doesn't count whoa Oh, he missed. Yeah, he punched. Oh. Wow, so eight points for the mess team. Now turn for Elijah. Oh, I thought it was going in. So 10 points for power break and eight points mm -hmm. for mass team. Ooh, you almost scratch. Oh, that was really close. Very close. Yeah. So I'm not sure if you can make the two. 
But probably he can take only hand. So Elijah is playing for 10 points. Table is really open. But you know, Luis, if Elijah is able to finish the rack, make 10 points, okay. then all the pressure is on Mateus. Because, he will need 15, right? Yeah. 15, yes or yes. <laughs> Do or die. Oh, tough position. Let's see the shot. Wow, great shot, Elijah. So that's 10 points. Now turn for Mateus and the only one chance for the mess team is to make 15. So he made one ball on the side. Oof. And looks like he needs to play a bank shot on the one. Oh, so that's a nine on the top right corner pocket. It's a nine, not the one. Yeah, it's a nine. The one is on the left. Okay, so yeah, I think he needs to play the bank on right side pocket, right? Yeah. The thing is that I don't know if he gets position on the two afterwards if he makes it. He made the one. Come on, come on, come on. What is going to happen? Oh my God, baby Jesus. Look at that now. I think we're going to see an Alberto. <laughs> Will you call every shot like that now? <laughs> Not every shot. Each shot, guys, there is some type of thin cut, and the player is going to give it a lot of pace, a lot of power to see what happens. That is what we call an Alberto. <laughs> yeah, but you know, I think he cannot play that hard because he's so close to the seven ball. He can play a draw and maybe try to make something. See, and Alberto, he tried. Oh, uh, so nothing went in. So, wow. Yeah, so it was two points. <laughs> Maluto and, and the Wonder Boy are so happy. They're celebrating. Yeah. I mean, it's beautiful to see that reaction because they care. I mean, yeah, of course they care. Good game. <laughs> Ooh. Great, great game. I think, so. I think this is what a pressure this... match. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having a heartache. <laughs> we, we are having a heart attack. <laughs> <laughs> so exciting. What a game. Okay. Nice game to now to watch. Take. Okay, thank you, Ivan. So, first of all, congratulations to the Power Break team. Well done. It was a really nice fight till the end. So, 
my esteem. Thank you very much. I, yeah, you had, Mateus, you had a really tough rack for this break. Yeah, start with the bank shot and uh, really hard to feel the uh, strength well to have the position on the two. I played a little bit too hard, which was pretty soft even. Uh, and I just uh, have the last chance to hit and hope. Uh, Actually, I was pretty close to make the 10 ball. In the, yeah, in the I saw it. I saw it. <laughs> yeah, you were close. <laughs> well, it was a really good effort. It was a beautiful bank shot on the one. You were able to clear some difficult racks. Yeah. So, well done, Mateus. And you were struggling at the beginning with the break. Yeah, the beginning was terrible. I struggled all the time with the breaks. Uh, I tried differently and all of them failed. Uh, yeah. Happy well, for me, but the second set, uh, the breaks come back to me uh, and I finish some good racks and that give us the decider. So a lot of yeah. pressure in the end, but it was nice. Yeah, I can imagine. Well, you found your break and you played excellent. So thank you, Mateus. Yeah. What? <laughs> can you hear me? Yeah. Yes, I can hear you. Okay. So, yeah, you had a few tough racks as well. This nine yeah. ball, you will practice this nine yeah, ball. <laughs> it wasn't a tough shot. It was just pressure, you know. Um, yeah. Yeah, I wanted to ask you, did you feel the pressure? Yes, of course. Of course I, I felt the pressure. I overran the position on the eight very much, uh, but I still made made it perfect for perfect shade on the nine. Uh, but I just mis mishit it a little bit and I overpowered it a lot. Uh, yeah, the, that, that shot lacked some control, that's for sure. Uh, in the in the meantime, during the match, I mean, I felt like I was playing good, but things were, weren't really going our way. I mean, I had a skid. I had a roll off on the 10 ball that I missed in the second set. I, I actually made it. So I was quite happy with my with my game, uh, but there were some tricky things. But still, we, we won the second set uh, thanks to some breaks and runs by, by Mateusz. And of course, I'm the most disappointed about uh, the last track because if I, if I made it, Mateusz would only need... A couple of balls, he would definitely take a ball in hand and would we would have a really good chance to win. So, of course, I'm disappointed, but congratulations to, to our opponents. But you made yeah. you made the shot of the match. You made the shot of the match. I mean, <laughs> yeah, that's that right. That, you made, that thin cut was the shot of the match. Yeah, I saved myself once. Yeah, that's true. But... <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't make well. up for it. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, thank you very much. It thank was. You. Thanks for it was... the presentation. Yeah, it was a great performance. You're welcome, guys. It's a pleasure. So, Paul break, Ivan, you want to say something? Uh, it's a nice game to us. Uh, nice game to watch, Texer. <laughs> then he's a <laughs> team. Then I was surprised about my last rap. It's very hard. <laughs> yeah, this last rap yeah. was really amazing. Very hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So... We're lucky that uh, we win this uh, match. So, thank you, sir. Yeah, thanks to you. What else buddy. I can say you? Good luck for the semi final. Thank you. And we hope you will keep playing the same or even better. So, thank that's you, all. Luis, you want to say something? Well, congratulations to the Power Break team, the mess team. I mean, you were a fighter. Mateus, you're mentally very strong because usually when a player has a couple or more dry breaks, when they make a ball, they, they miss balls because they lose confidence. But you were able to regain your break and run out amazing racks. So mentally, we learned that you're very strong. Uh, Voschek, I mean, of course you wanted to win, but you played amazing, a couple of mistakes. The, sh the shot of the match, I think this is the most exciting match we've had in the tournament so far, not only because of the decider, but that you came back and won the second set. So congratulations to all. Yeah. So, Bocek, you got a, a kick on the sixth, right? Yeah, yeah. When you played was, on the side. It, yeah, it wasn't really important because we have already almost lost this set, but I want to I wanna just justify my mistakes that it wasn't really a mistake because it looked silly. It was an easy shot, but it was a terrible Yeah, shot. yeah, because uh, you missed it by like too much. It yeah, was yeah, and the cue ball barely moved. And this 10 ball also, I, I missed position, but when I checked, it rolls off here. So uh, 
yeah, as you can see. Yeah, yeah. Goes to the so, side, so. so that was also worth six points, but it doesn't matter. We won the second set. The, the most important part was me missing the nine, and that's I just got, got to handle it. And what what you said was was very true. Congrats to Mateusz. I mean, exactly as you said, he's very strong mentally. There was a terrific performance after after mm -hmm. some uh, dry break. So I'm really proud of him. Yeah. So thank you very much. Beautiful. You should be proud of each other. You made a good tournament and we hope to see you in the next one. Thank you. Yeah, thank you very much. So thanks That's to all the viewers and we have the next match at 5 p.m. Central European time. We have a great match. So keep tuned and see you soon. Bye-bye. Thank, thank you, Sarah. Thank you. Bye. Bye.